Hi guys, my name is Steven Spring, and I'd like to welcome you to uh, what's going to be my YouTube channel, my video series, so to speak. Um, my channel is going to be a lot about technology, specifically a lot about um, my profession um, as a network technician, junior network engineer. Um, I'm going to be doing um, videos about several different things. I was going to do uh, tool bag tours, uh, my work truck tour, um, and then some networking um, tutorials, things like that. Um, really anything that you guys would be interested in, in watching about my life, uh, I'd be willing to do. Um, so I'll just start off by introducing myself. Um, I've been uh, in the industry of networking for the last couple years. Uh, before that, I was uh, still in the tech sector, um, started out in technical security, and then moved on to uh, do a broadband technician, uh, and then finally making my way to my new passion, my love and joy, which is networking. Um, uh, as for where I'll go in the future, um, I'm kind of exploring the security sector, uh, um, penetration testing, stuff like that really interests me. So as I learned that journey, I was going to post videos about, about that journey as well, if you guys were interested. Um, but right now I was just going to do network technician videos. Uh, I work at a rural WISP on the Washington, Idaho border. So, you know, I was going to take you guys out to the towers and, uh, Take you out to client side uh, um, setups. Uh, like I said, it's a WISP. It's a fixed wireless uh, WISP, a wireless internet service provider. And so I was going to show you kind of how that works, both in the commercial side and in the residential side. I can show you guys installs, things like that. Um, but let me know in the comments uh, if you'd like on what kind of videos you guys would like to see. Do you guys want to start with the tool bag tour? Do you guys want to start with the truck tour? Um, it's kind of open. I might just randomly post videos too, uh, depending on people's interest, uh, if people are even interested at all. So uh, right now, I just kind of want to show you, um, due to COVID, I'm working from home, even though I do work from home um, pretty often anyway, being in my job. I have remote access uh to my network uh, with just a uh, fixed wireless antenna, a radio ubiquity uh, power beam. And so I'm able to access the entire network, troubleshoot clients remotely, um, things like that. So I'm gonna switch you guys over to that and kind of show you my little setup. So starting up here, um, just because uh, due to COVID uh, and I am a little sick, uh, I've been operating out of home, so I do have some uh, Microtik routers. Um, we use uh, Microtik PIM routers uh, because we offer um, IPTV, so it's easier to use these um, to route the VLANs, and um, they just got all kinds of cool functions that I can go over in later videos. Um, these are some air cubes that I'm experimenting with. Uh, right now, we use, uh, usually just go from PoE to, uh, you know, a regular um, multiple service uh, um, device, something that has an access point, a switch, and a router in it, you know, just your common household, um, off-the-shelf uh, consumer brands. Um, right there, you see I got some CCNA books. Uh, for, for when I was practicing to take my CCNA. Um, and uh, right here, we have some laptops. Some of these I work, I'm working on per, personally for projects um, that I compose, just taking older laptops and, and putting stuff like Lubuntu or Ubuntu on it. Uh, 
and then a couple of these I'm working on for actual clients as well um, that I kind of do on a side business working on computers. Um, down here is kind of my office area. It's a kind of a mess right now. Um, you can see I have the air control server up. Air controls how we manage our ubiquity, um, our ubiquity network. Uh, that's what we use is ubiquity gear to manage our, our fixed wireless network. Um, I have a client up over here that I'm working on and then running pings um, to a problematic uh, a problematic node. So down here is my laptop uh, that I use for work for any on-site programming. It's a little Asus transformer and uh, I have Ubuntu loaded on this. It just makes uh, troubleshooting and uh moving about uh you know within my network easier on a uh, linux laptop uh over here we have some uh over here we have some raspberry pis and then a hap router uh, this is another microtik uh router that also has a wireless function because uh, on our iptv devices uh they do wireless so uh these are kind of for personal projects. Uh, sorry, I was out of frame. Uh, these are kind of for personal projects. Um, this one I was seeing if it worked um, because I found it at the office. It does not. Um, this one is actually, um, so there's, there's something called a Unify controller. Um, they're quite expensive. So if one of those goes down or we just, uh, feel the need to use it um, for a low cost solution. Sometimes we'll put uh, a ubiquity controller um, loaded up on a Raspberry Pi, makes it a cheap option, good for temporary stuff. So um, it's kind of the rest of my living room. It's a bit of a mess right now, but anyway, just kind of wanted to give you guys a a little general tour and introduce myself and um, if you guys are interested in seeing any videos go ahead and subscribe to me and request I'm I'm willing to do uh, any videos you guys want to see so yeah talk to you guys soon bye